Nevada is the driest state in the country, and now local scientists are using NASA satellites above Earth to estimate groundwater here and throughout the West. Fox 5's Kim Passoff spoke with them about how it works. She joins us now in studio. Yeah, so there are existing maps of groundwater, but most are decades old. And after a recent study, scientists at the Desert Research Institute now say that satellites can be used to get a much more accurate picture. In understanding how much water is being used, and how much water is left is really important. Water management is crucial in Nevada and throughout the West. Using two NASA satellites that continually orbit the Earth, scientists can get an image of the same location of Earth's surface every four days and can measure evapotranspiration, the water from plants, soil, and other surfaces that reach the atmosphere. If you have artificial grass or turf, um, many places in Las Vegas do. If you walk on that in the summertime, it's quite hot. However, then if you go over to a real, real lawn or real turf that is actually watered, it's much cooler. So evapotranspiration has kind of a cooling effect on the land surface. And we can pick that up with satellite data, which look at land surface temperature. So we can see cooler surfaces have more water use, warmer surfaces have less. And that's how we're able to estimate it from satellites. Thomas Odd is specifically interested in the images from this farm in Diamond Valley, Nevada. Growing up on a dairy farm, the Desert Research Institute scientist returned to his roots, conducting research on the alfalfa farm. I did about a month of field work while I was out there. Um, a farmer was gracious and let me stay at his uh, mobile home. Measurements taken from meters in the field of how much water was being used were compared to satellite estimates. Ott found the satellites were accurate. We show that we can predict it well. The study finding satellites high above the Earth can help us better understand the groundwater use below. And while the study compared groundwater meter data and satellite data in agricultural fields in both Nevada and Oregon, the hope is to be able to use satellite data to map groundwater in other locations, especially to address drought concerns and water conservation efforts. And that satellite data is available through a platform called OpenNet. It's now being used by some farmers across the western U.S. for improved water management. 